gonna gather my supplies. I always put my barrier on the top so I'm not having to dig through everything. So we're knock, knock, knock. Can I come in? Come in. Hi, my name is Robin. I'm your student nurse assistant for today. Is it okay if I check your ID, ma'am? Yes. Hi, Miss Smith. I'm here to change your position. Is that okay? All right. We're going to close the curtain. And I'm going to raise the bed to a good working level. Now, doing this on a mannequin is so much easier than doing it on a real person. Mm. Okay, so I'm going to lay flat. Okay, so before I put the side rail down, I'm going to walk around and make sure that the brake is on because I'm moving the person. Okay, so now I can put the side rail down and I'm going to cover him with the bath blanket. So I'm going to cover you up so with this bath blanket so you stay warm and we don't tangle your shoes up, okay? I know we've all grown up shaking out our sheets before we put them over, but can't do that. Okay, now I'm going to scoot you closer to me, okay? I'm going to do three segments, okay? So it's not, I'm not going to pick you up. So we go under the neck, at the neck and at the waist, and pull, and then we go to the waist and the knees, and pull them over, and then the feet come over too. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to bend his knee. I don't recommend that you uncover him at the Red Cross, but I want you to see what I'm doing. Okay, and then we're going to have them make a stop sign. There you go. I'm getting this arm out. So on a count of three, I'm going to turn you over. I want you to hold on to the side rail, okay? Ready? One, two, three. Make sure they stay covered. All right, so our first pillow open area away from the head of the bed. We're going to lift this up and we're going to make a tent or a triangle. You've got the resident's body, you've got the pillow, you've got the bed mattress. That's a triangle. Okay, and so then you're going to push down a little bit and then pull him back just a little so that he's resting on the pillow. And we're going to fold the pillow this way. And we're going to give him a friend. Okay, a friend to hug. You can adjust the pillow under his head too, if it looks like it needs it. All right, then I'm going to pick this back up. And now the last pillow is going to go between his legs. So we want to make sure that the bottom leg, the leg that's on the bed, is straight. And then you want the top leg just out and over. And then you're going to rest the top leg on the pillow, not on the bottom leg. Okay, we're trying to avoid all kinds of pressure points here. Okay. So then we're going to loosen all this up and make sure that 
when I go back over to pull the sheet up, he's not tangled. Are you comfortable, sir? Now, if this were me, I'd be wanting another pillow under my head, but it's a personal thing. So then we're going to take off the bath blanket. Into the dirty linen and straighten up his sheets for him. Okay, for this skill, I would actually come down to the end of the bed to check the body alignment because you want the ear, the shoulder, and the hip all in a line. Okay, so his body alignment is good. Brakes were on before I started. We're going to make sure that he has a call light. Okay, don't put it on this side because he's not going to be able to reach it. All right, and then we're going to put the bed down in the lowest position. Under the stove in the trash. Open the curtain, wash my hands, record a report. Okay?